gonna just say these out. <laughs> Why y'all get a fun? Don't make it shit. Don't make it shit. <laughs> people got hurt. It was like a riot type fight, not just a one-on-one -on -one fight. Oh. <laughs> like the whole section of this, this this prison was like everybody fighting. Like, you cool with them when they kill people? My type of people. I'm telling you. Yeah, you got into it with an officer. Yes, the hell, tweet the fuck out. <laughs> hey, everybody, it's Kayla Mira. Welcome, welcome back to my channel, y'all. In today's video, I'm here with my cousin, Deshaun. Say What's up, homeboys <laughs> and homegirls and brothers no. and sisters? He said he nervous, but he not acting nervous. <laughs> um, we doing a mukbang today. I got Zaxby's and I got, and he got Pizza Hut wings. And today we're just going to be talking about his prison experience. I got a few questions here that I'm going to be asking him. Not right now. <laughs> All right, so let's get into it before my camera dies. I had to take my glasses off, y'all, because the glare. But I can barely see y'all, so I hope I look okay. Definitely can barely see. <laughs> so first question. How was your first time in jail? And, like, how did you feel, like, when you first went? Ooh. I don't know. I was so mad. You know, I was just like, you know, gotta be done. I gotta go through it. I can't, I can't, I can't, you know, it ain't like you just something you can just quit. You gotta go do it. You know what I'm saying? I got one. But, uh, but yeah, though. Were you nervous? I wasn't really nervous. I just knew what laid ahead of me and I was just stressed more than anything. Uh huh. Yeah, but, um, you know, at the end of the day, I did it. it turned me to a man. First time, 17 years old, so, you know. He was 17, y'all, like, that's crazy. I'd be so scared. I'd be so scared. Okay, did you get along with your cellmates? Any of them? Yeah, I got along with them. All of them? Yeah, but you know, every now and then you have no head. You know, you know how they go. But, um, yeah, you know, for the most part, I definitely have a cordial relationship with everybody. Is jail or prison the same as it is on TV? If not, what's different really about it? They definitely be trying to hype it up on TV though. Like, I don't know if they're doing that to scare people or like kids or trying to see some lesson or what. But what's different about it? It's more laid back than what they try to make it seem. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like it ain't as bad as they try to make it seem. You know when, 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 when there's animosity on the yard, things happen, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, for the most part, it be chill. It don't really be not going on there, but it's just like the streets. Keep just in prison. You know what I'm saying? Everything is on the streets. It's in prison. You know Which one is jail? Better or prison? I mean, better or prison. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? The jail or prison? Most people would think prison is worse, but to me, I was so ready to get out of my county and go to prison so I can hit the yard and go outside. You know what I mean? Like in my county, how you know how fast now we be at? Um, it's definitely like a straight lockdown in that jail, so mm -hmm. you ain't seeing outside or none of that. So you know, I'm definitely ready to go to prison. That crazy that sound. Did you see like any bad fights? Like not just regular fights, like fights where people really got hurt. And did you fight? Of course. I have a couple fights, a couple scuffs. You have a, you have a you loss? Want you want nothing stress about them. You have a loss? <laughs> Don't lie, Ethan. <laughs> I lost one. You lost one? I lost one. <laughs> what, what, why y'all get a fight? I don't know. It was my nigga though, for real. You know, we really want no fight. It was just a little pass, a, a couple of pass, mm -hmm. which we were playing. I guess he got upset about something without me knowing he was upset. So, you know what I mean? He swung off shit. I didn't look swing. And that was easy, we broken up. Cause we, that's my homie, you know what I mean? Yeah. That's my nigga, so. You know. Oh, that's out now. Yeah, I mean, well, I ain't, I ain't been in contact with him in a while, but we could, yeah, that, that's that's it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cool out there. What's the we worst? Like, that's my dog. What's the worst fight you ever seen? Like, where somebody really got hurt? Get put to sleep. Really? Yeah, I mean, of course, you, you can see fights with blood, cause there ain't nothing to split this and make it bleed or bunch of those, but I'm talking about, like, really, Put sleep snoring, like wake up with a concussion type thing. Yeah, oh. that's probably about the worst. I'd have been scared in there. I ain't scared. You know, you know I grew, I grew up well, so <laughs> <That's about> me. <laughs> yeah, he been back. <laughs> Did you ever think to yourself like, I don't want to come back to jail. Like, I'm never come back here. And if so, when? 
but it was on twice that I sit in I sat in jail for like a long period of time. Mm -hmm. And the other time, I ain't never made it to the back. I was made blind. But um Like this last time when you went, did you think this last that? time I definitely said this is it. <laughs> can't tell you no more get too old. <laughs> I ain't have a fresh child yet. So, you know, it just, it's the hour. It made me want to see, it just made me cherish life and make me want to see more in the world. Right. Know? And just get out the hood instead of seeing the hood all the way. Yeah. What did you eat? Like, did you eat the food? Cause the food on TV make it look really nasty. Like, did you eat that food or did you make your own food? The food that looked like it looked on TV, definitely didn't eat that. <laughs> oh, so they did have that in there. That's Certain right. meals uh, look like it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, it's gonna be exact how it look, how they make it look. Mm -hmm. What's Boom. what's like the most creative thing you made? Mm -hmm. So many things. Got some I make called fried rice. I make fried rice out of like white rice and noodle. And I put like um I saute onions with it. How you saute onions in a sh in a sale? Hmm? How you did that in the sale? Cause you got, oh, you know, in prison you got microwave. Oh, so I put no, the seasoning on it, split it up a little bit. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Put the microwave, heat up. You know? Then put it in that one. I take, I take the rice, I steam it. I take some boiling hot water. I set it in that little bowl. I put the noodles in the bowl. Once the rice comes, I put it in the bowl. Mm -hmm. I take the seasoning from the noodles, put it in, put it in the noodles, stir all the rice together. Mm -hmm. So. The heat from the rice is gonna steam the noodles, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So boom, I put butter in there, you know what I mean? You put butter, whatever. I might put a little pickle juice, I put pickles in there then. Pickles? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's like fried rice, it's like, just imagine Chinese fried rice, but it just got like pickles in it. Yeah, I don't eat Chinese, so. Uh-uh. Like, why you gotta be so picky? <laughs> like, I don't eat. I just don't eat Chinese. Eat. Yeah. So fried rice is the most creative thing? How you make a swallow make steak you? cakes. Steak cake? What's yeah. that? You might make a steak cake one. You might like it. If you like sweet, you'll like steak cake. But that shit. Oh, it's sweet? sweet? Definitely sweet. What's in it? A honey bun, cookies, and whatever you want to put on it. Snickers. What in the world? Y'all make your shit. Don't make your shit, but it make your shit. <laughs> <laughs> you're stupid, bruh. Lord have mercy. Yeah, no, but yeah, no, it's a lot of sugar, crazy. though. It ain't something that you eat in one setting. Like, you take mm -hmm. a, Like, I take the. Uh, the um, cookies. I made mm -hmm. the dough out of cookies, but I take the cream out. You can keep it in, you know, no matter how you want to do it. Mm -hmm. But sometimes I take the cream out, decorate the top with, um, put a little milk in it. Okay. Make it loose and make it cream. You know what I'm saying? We just take the cookies, put milk in it until it get like mush. Mm -hmm. Not too much was water, but you know what I'm saying? Then take like little deodorant rolls by the plate, by the around. You know what I'm saying? Roll mm -hmm. them out. Roll them out to an even. You said what kind of roll? I go with, you know, a little steak deodorant that you. It's like, oh. just shaped like that, like a, you know, just round, some good roast I'm out with. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, put the hot on the honey bun up there. Mm -hmm. Boom. If, you know, some people eat pot tops or whatever. You know what I mean? They might put a uh, pot top up there, pot top up there, whatever. But me, I don't like too much. I might have Snickers or something. You know what I'm saying? You pick a Snickers over a pot top? Nah, I don't use pasta. I put a snake over the honey bun, then wrap it, the whole thing with the um, with the dough, mm -hmm. the cookie dough. Then I take the cream I use and put it on top. It's good. Yes, indeed. That'll probably make me sick. I don't know. I think you like. It. Um, how do people sneak stuff in jail? <laughs> how do people sneak stuff in jail? Huh. I'm sad because I be it's seeing it on. <laughs> <laughs> I've been saying it on TikTok. I can't tell you how they do it. All I know is they, they pop up with it. Okay. They pop up with it, and I write how they do that. You're like, what's that finesse? Whatever finesse means, I don't know. Somebody gonna have to tell me what that means. <laughs> Somebody tell me I'm finesse. Can't remember. Yeah, I'll wanna know. 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 Yeah, I'll Five. Fighting, that's the worst thing? Yeah, but people got hurt. It was like a riot type fight, not just a one-on-one -on -one fight. Um. <laughs> like the whole section of this, this this prison was like, everybody fighting like the whole world type thing. Where did it start from? Some shoes man stuff. All right, so it's already something stupid, ain't it? <laughs> oh, it's something stupid, bro. You know how it goes. Do they really put you like in a hole? 
definitely put me in hold. I actually I got demoted. I was in I was in green clothes, which is minimum custom. When you get minimum custom, you got level one, two, and three. Once you get level three, you get home passes if you got that much time. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So I'll pop up. I can come home on the weekends, yeah. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I didn't know they do that. Yeah, but I ended up messing that up. You know, they hit me with a sock charge and game charge. So they shipped me to another place. A game charge. <laughs> yeah. In prison. In prison. <laughs> yeah. This is an A4 this is an A4 and A14. You know what I'm saying? That's that's a sock charge, game, game on um, figures. Okay. So um boom. But well, I messed all that up, so they didn't send me to another prison, put me in the hole, then demoted me back to medium custody, which is brown code. So I ain't no going back to brown code prison. Medium custody. You know, so you got close, which is the worst, and medium, then it's medium. You know what What's, you ever heard, like, you ever heard, like, you know how you ask people, like, what they in there for? Like, what's the craziest thing you heard somebody was in there for? Or somebody told you they was in there for? Man, all types of stuff. Some of the older guys that I was really cool with, I call them unk. Like we really had a close relationship. Like they might have like two licenses plus thirty years. Like, you know what I'm but but you would never think because they personality, they such they they such good people at heart. You know what I mean? You would never know. You know what I'm saying? Why like, thirty? Whatever. Why they didn't for thirty years? Shit. <laughs> 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 they tell you. Yeah, well, killers by I guess. Most of the people, I guess. Hey. Like, they cool with me. I love them. They fuck me. They love me. Hey. Are you cool with them when they kill people? My type of people. I mean, I, no, I ain't, I ain't mean to say it like that. I honestly didn't mean to say it like that. I'm just saying. I just like being around. I just like being around the no nonsense type of people. The people mm -hmm. that. The people that like. I like structure. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Especially when I'm incarcerated and I'm doing time. I like to be in blocks where it's structured, but a lot of nonsense ain't going on. Where if, if a lot of nonsense do start going on, you know, it, it, it's a way to be handled properly. You know what I mean? You know, correct that. They have mm -hmm. peace in the block. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. so, you know, I ain't saying like that. Don't know. I'm, I'm so definitely like, a yeah, positive I don't person. Hang with all the killers. No, That's what I got from it. I don't, don't want to have to be nervous at time. You know what I'm mm -hmm. Do you want to tell them why you went or no? Or you can't? Cause they don't ask. First time. By the way, I just want to stop and say this right quick before I say anything else. Mm -hmm. Mafia tech. Music on the way. <laughs> Stay tuned. What we said again? Why you go to jail? Oh, oh yeah. This. My first time actually going to jail. Like for a serious charge, it was now 17 for attempted murder. And basically, it was a situation, a family situation. I ain't going too many details, but a family situation where all this case happened, and I basically had to protect myself, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And, you know, it wasn't even supposed to be that harsh, but, you know, we have a harsh justice system down here. Our justice system is really not a justice system. He's saying justice system, y'all. Justice system. <laughs> I'm country, what? <laughs> Y'all, 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 I hope y'all don't be saying about peas, no, for they country too. But anyway, but um, but yeah, though, not end up getting like a little over six years for that. Mm -hmm. And it was just, I just felt like they was out to get me for real, but I ain't playing, I ain't cry. Mm -hmm. I took it on the chin. When I went to prison, I was a little rough, and I was kind of like, cause I was stressed and I wanted to let off a little pressure, but uh, I ain't really not getting into no trouble, you know. And I can't, it turned into a man, so hey. What don't break you make it. You know what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. it turned me to who I am today and I'm a strong individual, so I ain't really got no complaint. That's good. Got anything else you want to share about your experience? Anything at all? What's your advice to people who are already acting up already, on their way to jail already? Alright, let me say this. If you out there, bullshit. I don't know why Bullshit. Yeah, that's what I call it. Mm -hmm. Man, listen. Freedom is everything. You feel what I'm saying? Like that's why I've learned. Cause now I'm approaching the 30 mark. So it was like now, okay, you know what? approaching the 30 year old mark. Uh oh. So it was like my eyes is really open now, especially with this last situation. And you know, I'm just like I said, I ain't even got my first child yet. So it was like it's so much to life other than that. It's like that. That's a whole nother world. We we segregated from this right here. We don't need. We blocked out from this. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they don't even let us watch the news. You know what I'm saying? With mm -hmm. certain situations going on. So you know. It's a different world, man, but 
just cherish the freedom, man. I ain't saying going out there snitch on people. That I don't, I don't, I don't, put, I don't, I don't put on that, you know. But um, you know, just stay to yourself, man. And, and 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 I ain't saying be perfect, be a saint, but you know, do what you gotta do to see. You know what I mean? Instead of making enemies and trying to be a part of this, when you know this ain't you. You know what I'm saying? Trying to be around this crowd, when you know this ain't your type of crowd. What? You know, because you ain't no getting hurt that we're doing something that you're gonna regret, because it ain't you. You know, right. I mean? you're faking for it. You know. So just think to yourself, man. It's so many ways to get money. So many ways to get money. So many ways to get money. You know. So just think to yourself. Rock along, and, and or you know, if you got the close ones that you rock with. You know, me. You know. I kind of motivate myself. I just in my mind is go hard or go home. And right. I ain't trying to go home, so I'm going hard as I can go. You know, because <laughs> I want to see the world. I want to travel. Right. I don't want to live that life no more. Right. You know, and it's always I always got jammed up because that's a crazy situation. I ain't mean, really being guilty of it, you know what I mean? But mm -hmm. like I said, I don't complain on oh, man. I take it and I keep it moving. Mm -hmm. But just that truck, man. Just that that shit, trouble. that shit right there. Man, it's not for no human. I tell <laughs> you. Yeah, gotta you gotta Too long, you won't, your mind won't be the same come back out for real, and I'm telling you. Yeah, you gotta like with an officer. Yes, the hell. <laughs> Because they were playing my food. They were playing your food? Playing my food and all my canteen. They tried to. Oh, okay. There's one guy, he's cool, but mm -hmm. he be going to your bag. Like, somebody leave your bag, somebody go home, they leave their canteen to you. Mm -hmm. He'll go in the bag and get something out and pass to people he cool with. Like, some of my shit was missing. Mm -hmm. So I called him, she tried to play with me. I got them shit. Who? <laughs> I, I tweaked out on it. I was mad. Oh. Start hollering. I was mad as hell. I just got big ears and I returned that. Look. That's your canteen. Yeah. You I told him, so go get the captain. I'm going to get the captain. Oh, they, they brought my shit back to me. The chair came back down the angle. I spent my money on this shit. You can't, you can't work and get money in here. Y'all already taxing the hell out of us for all this shit. Everything in, huh? Pack of noodles, a dollar and ten cents. What? A dollar and ten cents? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. A dollar and two cents. Hell yeah. <laughs> What? And no shit's 10 cent in the world. What? So how you make your money? What? Why you make money just? Wow. So wait, I mean, how did you, know. you get the news then? Like people was sending them to you? No, you know I had money in my books from my people send money from, from uh -huh. the outside world. You know. But like far as like trying to make a hustle like. They ain't do like the thing. Cause you know. Dad, he not have it. He used to cut hair. Yeah. See it ain't like enough. Uh, okay. See, when my home was in jail, shit, bro, whew. <laughs> you weren't even born. <laughs> <laughs> no. That was a minute ago. It made some cut hell, but ain't anybody charging nobody shit. They only got the proper equipment to even give you a, a nice, like a split fit edge or something like that. Yeah. So it ain't even nothing to buy pay for. It ain't worth it. Okay, got it. Did you have a girlfriend in jail? I meant to ask you that too. <laughs> Not from the outside world, I'm talking about in jail. Did you have a girlfriend? Oh, you gotta make that shit more clear, right? <laughs> yeah, don't lie. Let me see you. <laughs> a girlfriend, you know what I'm talking about. Did you have a girlfriend? Yeah, he didn't answer her. I got plenty of girlfriends. I ain't got life. I ain't got 230 years. <laughs> oh, so you had a little boom in the jail? Yeah, no, I ain't got no boom. Yeah, I'm out. Come on. Crazy as hell. You lost your damn body. Hey, listen. You ain't she about to eat this there. You know how, like, on TV they say, like, y'all can pass notes through the toilet? Did they do that no, for real? Through the toilet? Mm -hmm. Well, I think that's in prison. Hell no, I ain't in prison either. You ain't doing it in prison either? I'm not gonna yell. And I should have traveled through the vents. Uh huh. Here, but you ain't passing that bus to us. Hey, you ain't passing that through no toilet. Guys, I seen on the, um, I think it's called Jailbirds on Netflix. They can, like, Take the water out of the toilet, put it like in another like that, and then they take notes through the toilet. Yeah, but then how you, you, you how they, what you got to make that shit go all the way to the next room? <laughs> Damn, okay. they ain't got shit, they ain't got no damn. You gotta watch it, cause yeah, you gotta watch it. I ain't gotta watch it, cause I need that shit for real. That shit bullshit. <laughs> it is real. You yeah. gotta watch it. I hope y'all enjoyed this short <laughs> interview. This guy crazy. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Hit the bell so you get a notification every single time I post. Bye y'all.